here's the action on the new servo. Trax is tough. Time to send it. Do the walk of shame than pop a tire. So let's see. So far, you guys seen us bashing into those big boulders up there. Against that. So far, the only thing we broke. That's it. We ripped out the wire for the uh, front light, so I gotta just solder that back on. But other than that, still going. for today also what I did to this uh, body I drilled out these holes right here in the front so hopefully that'll help keep the motor cool actually I got the Traxxas app so let's see that's where my temp is at we still got 30 volts of battery That's not bad for out here running. It's about 80 degrees out here today in California. It's nice and sunny. Time to do some detailing.
damage was we ripped this front bite and this front bumper, the screws stripped out. Other than that, everything looks all right. Let's clean it and see what's, what else we broke. soak with the foam. Just go over it with this little detail brush. Get these on Amazon for cheap. Make sure we get all this stuff too. Cow RC is RC safe. For all your RC, all the plastics, electronics. any dirt mud Next, we're gonna dry with the hose, air hose. So I won't make you guys listen to that, but. Now that everything's dried off with the air hose, got all the electronics, everything, all the bearings dried out. Put a little rag over the electronics and we're gonna hit it with this Moose Slick silicone spray. You don't want it on your electronics. You don't want it on your plastic. And on all your moving parts.
also going to get the bottom of this chassis real quick. Make sure you get all your screws, keep them from rusting up. Now we should be good to go. Make sure you hit all the screws with this stuff. It's good for the screws. Axles. The back side is good bearing. Now to get my tires looking back new, I just spray them down with Awesome. And I just wipe them down with the uh, microfiber towel. They're all dried up. We hit them with this SC1, give them that shine. We're also going to hit the plastics. All the little plastics on here. Make it look brand new again. I just let it soak on there. Okay. Then we'll wipe down any excess. It'll give it a nice shine. You could also hit the body with it. it. Won't hurt it. It's good stuff. Hit the tires and make them look brand new again. And that's that. So far, the ultimate add-ons have held up pretty good. Shock caps, collars, hubs, a steering bell crank and servo, a saver, servo arm, motor mounts, gear cover, um, the washers for the motor mounts, all that stuff's held up so far good. So the only parts that we need to do uh, to finish this ultimate clone is these casters and steering for the aluminum in the front and the rear. The blue uh, links for the steering. The differential covers front and rear. And that's it. This this thing will be a full full blown clone. bash your body I'm not sure if those vents I put in the front there help but we didn't get no overheating on this thing today turn this into the monster edition monster fox That's the shelf body, X-Max Ultimate. There's 
sorry. Alright guys, thanks for watching.